Tape three, action. Uh, hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Mr. Fox Nine. This is Day Rambles. Today we're doing Flash, season one, episode nine. Then the title's called "The Man in a Yellow Suit," and it's my third take. Jeez. All right, so um, we start with it being Christmas time, and Barry and Iris are exchanging gifts, and Barry gives her a ring, and it was her mom's. It wasn't. It's not a real gold or anything. It's just like a recreation of it. Of like a duplicate. And so then Iris gives him a lab kit. And then um, Eddie is there and Eddie thinks that Barry has a crush. Like, welcome to like episode one, dummy. And then um, Eddie gives her a key because he wants her to move in with him. And then Caitlin's doing Christmas shopping, and she's going back to her car, and she sees uh, Spider Man slash Ronnie in the window of her car. But when she turns around, he's not there. And then the yellow man takes out two guards at a lab, it's Mercury Labs. And then, um, but before he could get his device, um, more security shows up and he escapes. And then um, we have Caitlin talking to Iris about. Um, Fireman about who he is, where he's been, all that type of stuff. Um, trying to locate him, and then um, Barry and Wells talk to Miss McGee, who is the head of Mercury Labs. And then we cut to where Caitlin talks to Cisco to find Ronnie, and then we have a flashback to the Allen family, which is like a cute little moment, it's like a little flashback moment. And then we have Iris and Barry talk. And then he starts to backtrack on about like crushing on her and stuff. So, because it's kind of obvious. And Eddie is like, talks to Iris, like, um, Barry's got a crush on you, just so you know. He's like, no, he's like, no, I don't. But he does. <laughs> and so, um, after that, because they're in his lab at the um, station and he sees a man in yellow after Iris leaves through um, the opposite building through the window. And so they uh, they raise and Barry gets his ass kicked. So hard. And then um, the Eddie wants info for the task force. He doesn't get it. And then Caitlin and Cisco find Ronnie and he just, he literally just says firestorm and Larry flies away. And it's super awkward because Cisco goes like, oh, that's so cool. He's like, oh, sorry, Caitlin. And then uh, Wells and Joe tell Barry to sit out on the man in yellow, not to worry about it. Then Caitlin and Cisco talk again, trying to find Ronnie again. And um, about a little bit of his backstory about how he got tracked in there, how Cisco's thought that that happened, but she doesn't blame him or anything. So um, Barry visits his dad in prison. A super emotional scene because he's like, I found, I finally found the man in yellow, and I'm so close to getting him. And but his dad said, just let it go. I'm very proud of you and all that type of stuff. So that's actually a super emotional scene because Barry's on the verge of crying. I think he does shed a couple of tears. And then Barry goes to talk to Iris again, and basically says, I love you to her. And Iris is speechless, and she doesn't have to add, and so he just kind of leaves. And then, um, then Starlight is trying to set a trap for the reverse flat or for the man in yellow, and it does work, um, but at first, but the force field does fail a little bit, and he kind of um, beats the crap out of um, Harrison Wells. Like, would he be some crap out of him? And punches him and does all this stuff, so that's kind of crazy. And then the first Flash um, also then beats everyone else up because the, flat, the force field just officially just fails. But beats everyone up except for Eddie, which is weird. And then we have the Flash versus the reverse Flash because um, he says, I'm, a, I'm the reverse of the Flash. So... And then, um, as they go outside, Ronnie swoops in and helps for a little bit, and then he leaves and tells Caitlin never to find me again as he's leaving. 
Then Joe tells um, Barry everything-ish, almost everything, but he definitely holds a little bit back. And then Joe and Barry have a heart-to-heart, -heart, which is super touching to see right there again. This is Christmas Eve time, and then Joe and Cisco have a theory, which they're going to work out in the next episode. And then we go to Wells and this, I'm just going to call it the future room. And it turns out he is the man in yellow. And he is the reverse flash. Wow. So when I um when I first saw this episode, like when it first came out, I was floored. Because I didn't I don't know really a whole bunch about comics. I just know about the TV shows and stuff. So but I'm trying to learn up on some of the stuff. So that's why I like the some like a channel like Emergency Awesome or Jawin is super good to learn stuff about that. But anyway, um, I really, really like this upset. I'm going to give this a plus. I love the character development. I like the twist with Harrison Wells because my first saw I was like, <gasps> what's happening? So I really do like all the character developments and all the scenes and stuff. I think everything is starting to work out and um, develop more. You have the intro of Ronnie in this, so that's pretty cool too. And yeah. So that's what I do for me. So if you like this episode, please give it a like, comment down below what you think of the episode. And then subscribe for more stuff coming for me because I have a lot more stuff coming up because we have less than a month until all the shows come back. And I got a lot to watch, a lot to record, and a lot to upload. So you'll see a very intense schedule coming up for me. So, But we're going to rock it out. We're going to see how it does. And I will see y'all in my next episode. I want y'all to have a super duper awesome day. Bye, everybody.